from a national perspective, as far as uh, the country is concerned, France, it's, it's absolutely huge. It's huge because when you're looking at golf tournaments across the world, you've got four majors, you've got the world championships. They're not easy to move, are they? You can't really move the, the Masters from Augusta and the British Open from Britain. So when France went out to, to say, right, we need something big to happen in the country to develop the game of golf for the Ryder Cup, so already bidding for it, then getting for it, getting, then getting it, it's obviously bringing media attention to the country and within the country, which is what the whole aim was. So it's just huge. It'd be fantastic for everybody involved at the Golf National to be a, a home winning European team course. And we're hoping that all the players, the officials, and everybody enjoys them three days and that we can take back some uh, fantastic memories as well as New friendship. We have a, a, a theater. Uh, uh, this golf course is uh, it's been designing for that. It was designed for, for hosting the French Open, but actually it's going to host the biggest competitions in, in, the, in the world of golf, and, uh, and it's a unique scenario. We, we, we know that. So we are, we are opening it, uh, and we've seen it. There is no almost any vegetation apart of the rough because uh, we want the, the, the spectator to, to enjoy the, the experience as much as we can. We're now talking about golf being as uh, a major part of French tourism, whereas gastronomy, uh, river Seine cruises, going up the Eiffel Tower, the Moulin Rouge, all of these things uh, you can do at the Ryder Cup, whereas if you think about other places where the Ryder Cup has been, it hasn't been there to do it. This is going to be a succeed. This is going to be good because the team is there, the guys know what they have to do, have the key guys, and we are training them and we have a plan. As years have gone by, the players said this would be probably the best Ryder Cup venue in history. So for the Golf National, I think it's just, just basically the confirmation of what it was destined to be.